Welcome you absolute legends, I am Former Freeze, I am Pete, I am back and today it's again first impressions time of this one, Lacoste LeBanc Au Fresh. It's only just come out in the UK, it's been out in America about a month now but I finally got this yesterday. I'm going to do a first unpacking of it today and I'm going to tell you what I think about it. So the presentation is pretty much normal, so if you really get excited about that, fair enough. I'm going to go straight into it. So. Hey, why do you have to put so much blue wrapping on things? I will say that's one of my pet peeves of life, but I don't care. And it takes blue 10 minutes to get into something that should take two seconds. Well, actually, that's a bit quicker than I normally do. So the box is normal stuff. Um, I've got a 100ml bottle, and that was running me £56. The 50ml bottle is 40 quid, so that's what it goes up. And then the bottle is the standard Lacoste sort of style bottle. But it's got a nice uh, gradient on the back, which is quite nice. I don't know if you can see that, the patterning on there. That's quite nice. Quite like that. So, it's time to uh, blast myself with this. So. Ooh. Okay, so straight away from the blast, you get some ginger, some lemon, some grapefruit straight away. It pops straight off the skin. And because it's got a lemon and ginger pop vibe, it's... Pop straight away. I'm also getting some juniper straight away, and it's definitely got some hybroxin in it because it's going to perform like a. It's definitely got that performance feel of it. I think, and there's some woods in here as well. But I'm just trying to get them. It can, there's a sort of hint of the woods, but not a lot straight away for the blast. My initial first impression is it's going to be a summer banger. I've got to be honest with you. I will say one thing. At the moment, at being a full retail, I probably wouldn't have bought this unless I was doing this. But at discount, is when it'll probably go in, I don't know, three to four, three a few months' time, I reckon this will be under 30 quid, 30, 40 quid. When it gets to that point, I would tell you now, pick it up. Well, now that the woods are starting to slip, I think it's a little bit of cedar and a bit of vetiver. And there's something, a couple of other things as well, but. And it's still got a little one or two a floral in it. But again, that kind of goes from the back of the Blanc one. And then they did the Fresh one. And then they had a baby. I made this one. Now, I haven't got the O Fresh one uh, but uh, to smell from. But this definitely has a floral note in it. Um, honestly, I'm not sure which one it is. But it's definitely got a floral note of some description. So this one... I think initially it's going to be supremely fresh. It's going to work well in the warmer weather. If it's got embroxing, which I think it has, it will last freaking hours. Now, if that's the case, for a Lacoste fragrance to last a long time and a freshie, if I get seven to eight hours out of this, I'll be damn happy. And if it gets the discounters, I think this is an absolute steal. A steal of a fragrance. Really, actually, I'm really quite impressed with it, actually. It's like I say, it's sparkly, it's poppy, it's really popping off my skin straight away. Okay, so my honest opinion is don't get it now. Wait till it hits discounters, buy it then, and enjoy it. Because I think in the summer, this one will just pop and work. And I guarantee you, if it's got the embroxing in it, people will notice it because it'll just perform really, really well. It's a really nice fragrance, actually. And for Lacoste to pull out this one, I'm fair play to them. I think they've looked at the market, what's going on, seen what works, and they've pulled out a really good fragrance. So I'm really pleased with this. I probably will put this in my summer rotation. But yeah, I think that's really nice. It's got everything you probably want out of a fresh fragrance. Um, I think it's an absolute winner. So there you go. Right, so there you have it, another post impressions. I've still got about 15 to go, so just bear with me. And I'll try and keep getting new releases as fast as I can. As always, um, thank you to my two hundred subscribers. I, I'll be honest with you, I wasn't expecting anything for the first six months. So to have 200 subscribers, you guys are absolute legends. I love you so much. I love when you hit me up with messages. I love them. Um, as always, I'm on Instagram with former fragrances. If you want a top 10 list, a fragrance review, or a question, Hit me up anytime you like, I'll happily help you. And as always, 
You absolute legends. Smell amazing. Thanks so much for watching. Peace out.